Greetings, Internet, and Happy Holidays! Welcome to a special Christmas edition of Eye on Uptown, your inside source for the happenings at the Uptown Music Collective. I'm Kendall Palmatier. And I'm Mitchell Gartner. In this episode, we will be talking about the recent Fall Music Showcase, our upcoming enrollment period, the last Christmas on 4th Street, and more. So let's get started. First up, let's talk about last weekend's Fall Music Showcase. Last Sunday, the Uptown Music Collective hosted its Fall Music Showcase at the Gennetti and Williamsport. Showcases are held once a semester, so collective students can present what they have learned at the school for their friends and family. The showcase was organized by students through a student leadership committee, just like our major performances. This makes the event feel more like a concert than a recital with students deciding set order, light, sound, and more. The Fall Music Showcase was a great success, and thank you to all the folks at the Jenny for the use of the room. To give you a little taste of what the showcase is like and a little bit of the prep that our students do to perform, check out this clip! What's your name? Marin Snow. And how long have you been taking lessons here at the Collective? Um, only a couple semesters, I'll tell them. Okay, and this is your first recital that you played in? Yeah. And what song are you playing? Folsom Prison Blues. Okay. Are you pretty excited? Yeah, I'm really excited. How long have you been working on the song for? Um, that's one of the first songs I've ever learned, and I, uh, I'm just like, it's fun to play with the band. semester. Enrollment week kicks off on January 4th. On Thursday night, January 9th, we'll be having our winter open house from 6 to 8 p.m. here at the Collective, so you can stop in and check out all the things the Collective has to offer. During Enrollment Week, the Collective will be accepting students on all levels, including absolute beginner on guitar, bass, drums, vocals, and piano, as well as enrollment in classes and workshops. And remember, the Collective is now offering free classes and workshops to all enrolled students. To get all the enrollment information, visit the Collective's website and click on the Enroll button on the homepage, or just contact our admissions director, Brendan, by calling 570-329-0888. 2016 is going to be a historic year for the Collective, so the best time to get involved is now. The New York-based organization Gift of Guitars brought Christmas to the students of the Uptown Music Collective a few weeks early this year, gifting us with the brand new Telecaster-style Robert Riley guitar. The guitar, donated by owners Robert and Sherry Richardson, will be available for students to use for practice, in workshops and lessons, as well as our large number of performances. Gift of Guitars Incorporated was formed for the charitable purpose of donating guitars and related musical accessories. The guitars are built, assembled, or refurbished by the company or obtained through donation. The guitars are then donated to other charitable organizations that utilize these items in their charitable work with the public. The company is owned by Bob and Sherry Richardson. You can find out more about the company by going to their website at giftofguitars.org. To get an up close and personal look at the new addition to the collective's arsenal of guitars, here's Enzo with a brand new edition of Gearheads. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to another edition of Gearheads. As you already know, we will be taking an in-depth look at this fine Robert Riley guitar. The company sources their parts from a wide variety of locations, which are inspected and assembled in their Huntington, New York workshop. This guitar features a beautiful sunburst finish and a maple fingerboard. The nameplate and backplate were produced using their very own 3D printer and look great! Let's have a listen. Go 
friends. Keep checking back for more gear reviews. Speaking of Christmas gifts, we should really get the collective decorated. After all, this will be the collective's last Christmas here on 4th Street. Um, it's already done. <laughs> oh, what? What do you mean it's already decorated? Yeah, we got together and did it this week. Here, this will get you up to speed. Off 2016 with two sure to be epic performances. First up, on January 14th, 15th, and 16th, the Uptown Music Collective will take to the Community Theater League stage in Williamsport to present Fleetwood Mac, Rumors, and Other Stories. The concert will feature all of the songs from the historic album Rumors, as well as assorted songs from the band's history and from their solo projects. Tickets have been moving so well for the show, we had to add another performance on the afternoon of the 16th. Be sure to get your tickets today by visiting ctlshows.com. On February 6th, the Collective will be back at the Community Arts Center to present Family Tradition, a tribute to Outlaw Country. The show is the winner of the People's Choice voting, which took place earlier this year. This will be a one-night-only fundraising concert for the Collective's Dream Home Project, and we are looking to pack the house. There will be more details in the coming weeks, but make sure you save the date of February 6th so you don't miss the Collective's first country-themed show. Thank you for checking out this holiday episode of Ion Uptown. If you like what you see, please make sure to subscribe to our channel and share this video for your friends to check out. We will be back in 2016 with brand new episodes of ION. For now, this has been ION Uptown, your inside source for the happenings at the Uptown Music Collective. Happy 